How's it going, everybody? This is the 2012-2013 National Treasures Basketball. It's a three-box case, three boxes back in the day here. And this is a random team's number one. Um, a lot of great rookies in this. Double rookie class product here. So I'm pretty excited. All 30 teams are in. Everyone gets a random team, so good luck. Thanks, for everyone, for getting in. Uh, maybe we'll get another case of this if uh, if seems like people liked it. I just posted it yesterday, and it, it sold out pretty quick, so... We're going to go eight times. Good luck, everybody. So I got all 30 names. Jeremy M. with the last spot there. And we got 30 teams right there. Six and a two, eight times. We're going to go to the names first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. We got Adam down to Joseph. Adam down to Joseph right there. Now for eight times on the list of teams. All teams in. Remember back in 2012-13, um, there was a couple of team changed, uh, name changes. So any Charlotte Bobcats cards go to the Charlotte Hornets. So it just stick, sticks with the city. So if it's a New Orleans Hornets card, Anthony Davis, New Orleans Hornets, it goes to the New Orleans Pelicans. So the city stays with the city. And we go by the checklist. So any redemptions on that, we'll do that. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eighth and final time. Eight, hot Atlanta down to Dallas. So here we go. Adam Kelly, Atlanta Hawks, David S, Boston Celtics. Last spot, Mojo, Jeremy Murrow gets the Lakers. Wow, nice one there. Darren with the Thunder, Ryan McGregor, Heat. Cody Sixers, Regimel Spurs, Ryan Kings, Scott Grizzlies, Ryan Pistons, Mark Rockets, Tony Jazz. Gavin, you got the Charlotte Hornets, which were the Charlotte Bobcats back then, so you get any Charlotte Bobcats cards. Chad Cavaliers, Bradley Wizards, Mark Bucks, Joseph Nets, Tony Timberwolves, Steve Raptors, Jeremy 33, Pacers, Jeremy Murrow, Warriors. Boombox, Suns, Chad, Bulls, Mark, Boombox, Magic, Gregory, you got the Clippers and the Knicks, Jason, you got the New Orleans Pelicans slash Hornets, Gavin, you got the Nuggets, Jordan, you got the Blazers, and Joseph, you got the Mavericks. Ryan, how's it going? What's up, Sam? Um... I'll make sure they answer that tonight if, if you didn't get an answer yet. Um, they just got back in the office today. So if you send it on the weekend, usually takes maybe a day or so. Uh, but I'll definitely uh, take a look at that for you. All right. No problem. Anybody want to trade? Let me know. Give it some minutes. Um, we don't have anything else sold out. The next closest break, four left in the Prisoptic baseball. All right, sounds good, Ryan. Yeah, you don't have to don't have to break and drive <laughs> if you're on the freeway. Suggest not to do that. Um, we have the hockey puck mixer there. Fourteen left. Would love to do that. Quizza Football, Pantheon, Black Old Collegiate. We have the Dual NT Case Break, which is down to 17. And then we have 19 left in just a one case of the 2018 House Chargers Baseball. Um, if that NT Baseball Dual Case doesn't go tonight, remember, that is a pretty expensive break. So we do ask some people just to kind of give it some time. I just posted it Sunday. And we usually don't break on Sundays, you know. So um, I'd love to do that tonight. Uh, 17 left there. We got the 
18 national treasures, and I'll take 521 out there just so there's not confusion. Um, what's up, Chris? Yeah, I definitely will have that um, that product. Yeah, I think it might have gotten delayed, though. I don't know. Um, anybody want the Mavs? Joseph Matthews has the Mavs. Let me check for that. But generally, the the pre-orders go probably about two or three days. Yeah, that's actually June twelfth now, so they must have must have uh, pushed it back. But we'll definitely have that. Yeah, like I said, probably. Um, what's that? A Friday. No, Wednesday, June twelfth. So yeah, that'll probably be posted June 9th, June tenth. Um, the next that's next basketball, I think too. So we'll try to get some more um kind of older basketball stuff. Maybe I'll try to get another twelve, thirteen NT case. Um, might go up in price, but on our side, if Kawhi goes to the playoffs, might have to buy it, or Kawhi goes to the. I almost said Super Bowl. The NBA Finals. Alright. Sorry, Joseph. I don't see anybody... Anybody trading, but maybe some try to trade couldn't trade Mojo. I'm going to go ahead and start this. There's the checklist Joe just posted. We're going to go by that, remember? So, a lot of guys in the NBA are traded. I know Jimmy Butler... Um, bounced around. He's on the Bulls in his rookie year, obviously. Um, Tobias Harris was what? Uh, a Magic? He was a Magic back in the day. So remember that, and remember our New Orleans goes to New Orleans, Charlotte goes to Charlotte. Other than that, I wish everybody good luck. Hopefully we can have uh, a nice case here. Maybe a logo man's been marinating in here. Who knows? I'm really excited for this one. Appreciate everyone getting in. We're going to try to do bring back some more older basketball stuff. Um, hey, maybe if Greek Freak makes it to the to the finals in the Bucks, you know, we'll have some 13-14 stuff. Um, I know that's really expensive right now, but maybe we can get a product like Preferred maybe or something like that. Um, but definitely we'll try to get some more 12 13 it's kind of an underrated class um, I think a lot of people are kind of sleeping on Anthony Davis and Kyrie Irving who are both in here because there's not a team I mean Pelicans fans probably don't want to buy any Anthony Davis cards right now and I know Boston fans don't want any Kyrie Irving cards so I think their secondary market might be going up once they sign with a team especially if it's a big uh big market team that gets those guys. I'm assuming both of them are not going to be with their respective teams next year, but I guess Anthony Davis has a chance to stay. Kyrie, I think, pretty much gone, I would assume. Yeah, it was because of the lockout. Pretty crazy. This was right before the Jaspi breaking days. Just about a year before we started. All right, so we got the plate on the bottom. Actually, two, right? Yeah, they used to do two. And they do the thin plates back then. Of course, it's now the... They put them on that NT stock now, which is kind of cool. All right. So the printing plates. First one is JaVale McGee. Actually, I have to look this one up. Looks like Denver, though. Yeah, Denver Nuggets on his jersey right there. That's from 1213 certified. Denver, that's Gavin Cook. Nick Jaspi rookie card, yeah. Eventually, if case breaking becomes so big, Panini might do a case breaking set. That'd be cool, right? All 12 people buying it. 
Um, and then there is Luke Mba Amute. Atlanta Hawks. Atlanta Hawks. That is Adam Kelly. So Joe sends his train whistles for these two teams. Printing plates. All right, now into the box. Let's do it. There's Al Jefferson, Utah Jazz, 13 out of 25. Utah, that is going to Tony Barkey. 2025 Panini Company. It'll be like the the video game cards or the video game streamers. It'll be more popular than the athletes. Brooklyn Nets on the board. That's six out of twenty-five. That is Darren Williams. Dual relic and autograph. Brooklyn. No sleep to Joseph. With that one. Looks like an RPA right here. Number 199, that is Dion Waiters. Cavs edition. That's the RPA number 199. That is Cleveland. That is Chad. Not sure. Maybe we'll have another RPA in this case. We'll see. RPA number 199. This one is going to the Washington Wizards. 11 out of 25. That's Trevor Booker. Who. I think. Maybe I'm misremembering. Um, looks like the old school Wizards jerseys. The Michael Jordan era. That's Bradley Marshall. Dual auto. Teach me how to jimmer. Jimmer for that and Evan Fournier. It's actually a pretty nice one. 11 versus 12. That is a randomizer between the Kings and Nuggets. Kings, Ryan, and then the Nuggets were Gavin. So that'll be a randomizer between those two. I think Jimmer for back in the league, right? Back playing in the U.S. Bulls, maybe? Ooh, this one's nice. There's a South Beach version of LeBron James, dual patch 14 of 25. Nice. That's a keeper. Miami Heat, that's Ryan. The nice LeBron dual patch. Very nice. Dual Relic, another randomizer. This one is Blazers and Heat. Marcus Aldridge, Chris Bosch. 23 out of 49. Portland is going to Joran, and Miami is going to Ryan. That's a randomizer as well. And we have a Russell Westbrook. 41 out of 49. Oklahoma City Thunder right there. Timeline Relic. OKC, Darren. Yeah, Panini should still honor it. Or else the value is really high, so. Should should replace it for a pretty, pretty big card. And then you had the Kobe Bryant Anthology. Lakers, that is Jeremy Merle. Guys trying to steal our NT. Box two. Yeah, they put those Kobe cards in every single 12-13 release. They also put the Kobe packs in some certain products. Which I remember back in the day when we opened 12-13 stuff a lot more often. People would get mad for us giving it to the Lakers. I'm like, it's like Kobe Bryant. It's, of course it's Lakers. Um, I think Panini Inc. the a brand new deal with Kobe for exclusive memorabilia. And I guess maybe that was part of the deal. I don't know where else would Kobe go. He, I mean, Hornets. <laughs> Got drafted by Charlotte, I guess. 
But no, this is uh this is definitely Lakers. Kobe Bryant. Man, Logan, not a Lakers fan. Not a Kobe fan, which I understand. All right, there is Charlotte. Can't say I know that player. I can't even guess. Byron Mullins. Charlotte Hornets. Chad. And we have a Crusade 101 printing plate. That is, looks like Jeremy Lin. Mark. From 1213 Crusade. 18 and 25, Steph Curry. Nice one for Golden State, Jeremy. I like to snap at the boxes too. That's one of the best parts of NT. Well, nowadays they they I think they know that people like that, so they they play to their audience, which is cool. I mean, it's like Rush playing their best songs or whatever. Four of ten, Darren Collison for the Mavericks. Play the hits, Dallas. That's Joseph, who's who said earlier, just my luck to get Dallas. Of course, Dallas obviously a big one to get this year. 18-19. Andre Iguodala, Nuggets edition, 15 of 25. What, a year or two before he went to Golden State, I think? Uh, Denver, that's Gavin. I can name maybe one or two songs. Tom Sawyer, I think that's all I can name. Ooh, this is a nice one for the Kings. That's a nice RPA, 178 out of 199. Jimmer for that. Still a nice card. Going to the Kings. That's Ryan. I'm sure he's got a big China fan base, right? Playing overseas for so long. True RPA of Jimmer. Redemption for a 11 verse 12 signatures Emerald. Chandler Parsons, Harrison Barnes. So Harrison Barnes should be Warriors. Chandler Parsons, maybe Houston? I don't think he was on Memphis back then. That's another randomizer. So Parsons is Houston, and Barnes is, yes, Warriors. Yeah, Jimmer was uh, BYU. That's a randomizer at the end. This is also a randomizer. Blazers and Pacers. Nolan Smith, Miles Plumley. 31 of 99, 11 verse 12. Joran and Jeremy, 33. We have a matchups, another randomizer. Wow. They were not thinking of group breakers back in 12 13. That's Paul Pierce, Monon Ginobili. Boston. David S. San Antonio Regimel to 99. There's Mello, 37-49. Relic for the Knicks. That's going to Gregory. You're probably right. And we have a NBA gear. That is Trevor Ariza, 77 of 99. Wizards version, Bradley. Um, I th Yeah, I think, I mean, he was definitely electric college player. Not sure if they ever had a huge tournament run, though. crack on this one yeah he was unreal from three point just whatchamacallit he was just lights out 
And then there's that video. Um, that song "Teach Me How to Doggy" was really big. So they did a they did a mixtape to to that song "Teach Me How to Jimmer," and it was just a highlight reel. Colby. These are not numbered. I know some of them are probably. Oh, Sweet 16. Oh, yeah. So they did make a little run there. Probably what, like an 8 seed or something? San Antonio, 1 1 plate. Gary Neal, 1 1 plate for Carl Landry, who I can't see his uniform. Now plays for the Hiroshima Dragonflies, which we didn't sell in this one. But 12-13, he was Golden State Warriors. So Golden State, that one's Jeremy Merle. Or Houston? Yeah, I'm showing. There's no check. He's not on the checklist. They didn't do printing plates. So 12-13, this should be a Warriors uniform, but obviously tough to tell, kind of. Um, cause all these plates are 12, 13, so that's when it'd be depicted. So I'm guessing they, they put him in a, in a Warriors uniform, 12, 13. So I'll check the 12, 13 crusade checklist. That's what I, I should do. So I'll do that at the end, but I'm guessing Warriors. All right. Darren Collison to 99 base for the Mavs. Joseph. We've got a nice one coming up. It was uh, Carl Landry from 1213 Crusade. We need to go to the 1213 Crusade checklist and then look it up. Look at this hit. Triple autograph. Isaiah Thomas, Joe Dumars, and Chauncey Billups. 8 out of 10. Nice triple championship national treasure signatures, triple auto. Ryan McGregor with the Pistons. Very nice hit. Jimmer logo, man, that would be a huge card, I bet. So that's a nice triple auto there. The RPA, Quincy AC, number to 99 this time. That's Toronto, Steve Locke. Number to 99. But I can check the, the checklist for that crusade at the end for sure. Yeah, it's a long time ago. And he's on Hiroshima now. We have Andrew Nicholson, Marcus Morris. Well, I'm not going to guess. Marcus Morris played for a ton of teams. And Nicholson might be Magic. Yeah, Nicholson is Magic. Marcus Morris is Rockets. Just randomizer between those two teams. Reggie Jackson, Will Barton to 99. Dual auto. Thunder. Darren. Blazers, who I think are in like three randomizers at this point. Um, that's going out to Joran. Next, 8 out of 25, that is Andrea Bariani. Toronto version. Steve Locke. 8 out of 25. There is a Colossal, 73 of 99, Pau Gasol. Who carried Kobe to a championship? That's Jeremy Murrow, last spot mojo. I know, right? There's a ton of randomizers. And we have number 99, that's Josh Smith. Last hit of the break for the Hawks, Adam Kelly. 
So I appreciate everyone getting in. None of the huge rookies, but I appreciate everyone giving a shot here. Um, so that was the break. So thanks, everybody. I'm going to do all these randomizers here. <laughs> I feel like Lakers fans, they don't respect Pow enough. Okay, so Joe did some research. Thanks, Joe. He says the 1213 Crusade checklist does show Warriors. So that is going to Golden State, Carl Landry. So that 101 printing plate. There you go, Warriors. Gets the Carl Landry. Um, let's set up these randomizers, though. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, which I thought we had more. It felt like way more, but I think I got them all. Yeah, six. Cool. Not so bad. All right, so let's open up. Randomizer, we're going to roll one dice for all six as we do. One, two, three, four, five, six. So the first one is Andrew Nicholson, which is magic. And I already forgot um, Marcus Morris was Houston, I believe. Rockets. Next one, Chandler Parsons was also Rockets. Harrison Barnes was Warriors. Um, I'm not sure. This might be out of five, this... Um, Chandler Parsons, Harrison Barnes is an emerald. So I think that might be out of five. Green usually out of five for Panini. Next one's Jimmer Fredette, Kings, Evan Fournier, Nuggets. Back in 1213, Evan Fournier was a Nugget, so that's who gets a shot at the card. Um, 1213, Lamarcus Aldridge, Chris Bosch, Heat, Blazers, and Heat. The next one is a Nolan Smith Blazers. Miles Plumley Pacers. And the final one, Paul Pierce Celtics, Manu Spurs. One dice roll for all six. Good luck, everybody. Bam. Two and three, five times. Ooh, Emerald out of ten. Nice. Joe, stack guy today. I like it. Bringing all the facts. All right, so the first one, Magic Rockets. One, two, three, four, five. After five times, Rockets stick on top for that one. The Andrew Nicholson, Marcus Morris dual autograph goes to Houston. Mark Irons. Uh, next one, five times, Rockets Warriors for the dual auto out of 10, according to CardboardConnection.com. Ch uh, Chandler Parsons, Harrison Barnes, Rockets Warriors, five times. One, two, three, four, and five. Golden State. Golden State, Harrison Barnes on the top for that one. That's Jeremy Merle. Next one up five times. That's Kings Nuggets. Jimmer Fredette, Evan Fournier to 25. Five times. One, two, three, four, and five. Nuggets. Shoot. I guess I'll do it after. So Nuggets stuck on top for the dual auto. Jimmer Fredette, Evan Fournier. That is going to Gavin. Five times. Blazers Heat. For Marcus Aldridge, Chris Bosch. Two, three, four, and five. Heat stick on top five times. Ryan McGregor. Five times Blazers Pacers. Nolan Smith, Miles Plumley. Dual autograph. One, two, three, four, five. Indiana. Jeremy 33. And five times on the Paul Pierce Manu Ginobili. One. Two, three, 
four, five. San Antonio flips on top. That's Regmo. So there you go. Really appreciate everyone getting in. That was 12-13 NT basketball. Three box case break. Numero uno. Um, like I said, stay tuned. Um, be sure to check our emails out. I usually send them out Tuesday through Saturday. Um, once a day. But we should be able to get another 12-13, uh, like I said. Um, so thanks, everybody, for getting in. Thanks for trying. And congrats to all the winners.